Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Rebecca Pryor. A family who has rescued and fostered countless animals over the years lost their home in a devastating fire earlier this week. KSAU 9's Jessica Watson shows us how a family that's given so much back to our community is receiving the help that they deserve in return. That's our top story. The Jarvis family has been a part of the Siouxland community for over 12 years, giving back to animals in need, fostering over 700 dogs through Noah's Hope Animal Rescue. But last Thursday, tragedy struck. Crazy. It's just crazy. A house fire left the family with nothing but the clothes on their backs. If we were sleeping, I think we would have seen the fire before, and yep. by that time it would have been too late. Now, a family that gives so much is left with so little, but the community isn't letting them go it alone. Um, I'm sorry for what they went through, but I know they have a lot of support in the community and, and their friends, so glad we can be there for them. In the midst of the disaster, the Jarvises continue to think of others and planned for a Noah's Hope adoption event at the Musketeers game, but the community took it one step further. Deanna, she has done so much in the community for the pets and when I saw on Facebook that she had lost everything, but she was still going through, getting all the volunteers, still doing everything for the pets, we wanted to try to give back to her as well. A silent auction was held to raise money for the family in need. The support that we've received have been from people who have adopted dogs from me, and that means a lot. It's like we're, we're just a family, we're not just given them a dog we're giving them a part of our family and it's kind of coming back to where we're seeing that now reporting in sioux city jessica watson kcau 9 news